हेलो फ्रेंड्स एंड वेलकम टू दिस न्यू सेशन ऑफ द टेराफॉर्म इंटरव्यू सिनेरियो बेस्ड क्वेश्चन सीरीज माय नेम इज़ आलोक कुमार एंड टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस ऑन द न्यू सिनेरियो बेस्ड क्वेश्चंस दैट मे बी आस्क्ड इन योर इंटरव्यू फॉर द डेवॉप्स यू हैव अ टेराफॉर्म कॉन्फिग्रेशंस डैट प्रोविजन्स एंड ई सी टू इंस्टेंस सिक्योरिटी ग्रुप्स एंड की पेयर You want to add a new EBS volume to the EC2 instance. How would you go about doing this? So this question is asking you to create an EBS volume and attach with the existing EC2 instance that is managed by the Terraform. So that instance of the EC2 is created by the Terraform itself. Okay. so to add a new ebs volume to an existing ec2 instance that is managed by the terraform you have to follow a certain steps you need to define a new ebs volume resources so in the terraform configuration file you define a new ebs volume resources using the ebs volume ebs underscore or you can say the aws underscore ebs underscore volume resource type this is the correct name so for example you can define the resource okay the resource name should be aws underscore volume okay abs underscore volume the local name whatever you want to use it you can in my case my underscore ebs the availability zone i will i am defining it and the size is 20 gb the size is 20 gb and the tag we are providing the name of the ebs which we we want to just um, uh, give us uh, a, a name to that particular uh, ebs uh, volume so using this code a new ebs volume is defined uh, with the size 20 gb and the tag name is my underscore web underscore ebs now it's time to attach this ebs volume to the ec2 instance so for that we we are going to use the resource aws underscore volume underscore attach below uh, snippet of code you can refer so resource we are defining aws volume underscore attach ebs ebs attach okay so the device name we are using the dev under uh, slash sdf and here we have to provide the volume okay so volume detail how we can get it we can get it from here okay we can get it from using the aws underscore ebs volume dot under my underscore uh, ebs and id okay and the aws instance you already created and that is managed by the terraform itself so this is the resource name and aws underscore instance and this is the local name we provided at the time of creation of the aws instance and this is the id so we are just mapping it okay so in, in this example the ebs volume is attached to the ec2 instance and this is the id we are providing using the device name okay now it's time to apply the changes after defining defining the ebs volume and attaching it to the ec2 instance apply your terraform changes with the terraform apply command this will provision a new ebs volume and it will attach to the ec2 instance so you have the existing ec2 instance okay this is managed by the terraform and ebs volume that you created okay you are attaching it okay and this is managed by the data form so these are the step through which you can add a new ebs volume to the existing ec2 instance and that is managed by the data form itself this allow you to automate your infrastructure management and ensure consistency and reliability across your applications okay so in future if you want to just um, uh, remove the mapping you just need to uh, modify your configurations of the mapping of the ec2 instance with the ebs volume hope you like this video 
if you didn't subscribe my channel yet please do subscribe it share with it with your friends as well this always motivate me thanks thanks for watching this video